The E-Myth Revisited, Why Most Small Businesses Don't Work and What to Do About It by Michael E. Gerber is a game-changing guide for entrepreneurs that busts the myth that small businesses are started by entrepreneurs who risk money to make money. Instead, Gerber shows that most small businesses are started by experts who are good at some kind of technical work but don't know anything about running a business and often struggle or fail. The main character in the book is not a person, but an idea called the E-Myth, or the Entrepreneurial Myth. This myth says that someone who is good at a technical job will also be good at running a business based on that task. Gerber says, though, that this is rarely true. This myth and the confusion it spreads become the story's main character, causing many small business owners to face problems they can't see. In the book, Sarah, the owner of a pie shop, is a stand-in for every small business owner who starts a business because they love what they do but fails to grow or run it well. As Sarah runs her business and runs into problems, Gerber uses Sarah's story to teach and warn the audience. This gives the technical parts of his lessons more weight and importance. As the book goes on, a number of important revelations about how to run a business well come to light. Gerber's main point, which is the difference between working on your business and working in your business, is at the heart of these new ideas. Gerber says that if you want to be successful, you need to be a business and not just a technician. He goes on to talk about how a business owner has three different personalities, the entrepreneur, the manager, and the technician. The entrepreneur is a thinker, a dreamer, and a creative person who knows how to solve problems. The manager is the practical person who organizes, plans, and brings order. The technician is the person who does things and the expert. The success of a business depends on how well these jobs are balanced. Then, Gerber talks about the turnkey revolution, which is based on the idea of franchise companies. The idea is to build your business as if you were going to sell it as a franchise. In other words, make systems, processes, and manuals of how your business works so that your business plan can be copied. This idea is what Sarah and, by extension, the reader need to change the way they run their businesses. The ideas in The E-Myth Revisited come from the psychology of entrepreneurs and from real-world business strategies. The main point of the book is to show that the E-Myth is not true and that technical skill does not mean business success. Subthemes include understanding and balancing the three sides of a business owner's personality and learning to think in terms of systems through the turnkey revolution. Gerber uses a lot of examples and pictures to show how his ideas work. For example, he often uses the McDonald's franchise model to show how well systematized, process-based business planning works. By giving examples like these, Gerber makes his ideas real and easy to understand. He also gives his readers useful ideas they can use in their own businesses. In the end, The E-Myth Revisited is a gripping story that shows how many small businesses fail because of false beliefs and gives deep insights into how to turn these failures into successes. It's a story of change that every hopeful entrepreneur and small business owner should learn from. After reading it, they'll have a better idea of what it takes to be successful in the business world.